brother to come back. I said, are you interested? <laughs> we are, we are, we are. Okay, yeah, you're good. Go ahead, huh? Alright. Yeah, you know, we out here, like I said, we in the spirit of Yahweh Bashan al Shad, not the spirit of this goddamn dark ass, demonic, disgusting world, man. And we out here to condemn this world. You know? Alright. Go ahead, go ahead. This is Proverbs 19 and 20. Hear counsel and receive instruction that thou mayest be wise in thy latter end. But yeah, that's it. We basically um we are we are um we going around righteous counsel and not being involved in the um in the in the affairs of the world. That's right. Because we already know what it's gonna lead to. Destruction. Right, bro. Right, yo, you know? This this world is ruthless, man. Uh-huh. Right? Alright? This world is ruthless, man. This is a wicked world that we live in, man. Yep. Alright? You could get you could get taken out easy, man. Alright? All of these grease balls. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. These people that got all kinds of money and they got all kinds of status. They 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 they, they, they uh you know they got they got they, they lurk in the shadows, they they work behind the scenes. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? All they gotta do is give, you know, pay off people and they have them do their dirty work for them. That's right. This is a fucking, this is a, man, this is a treacherous society, man, yeah. that we live in. It. That's why this, the Yahweh Shemeshach gotta be with us, bro, because we, we in the, we in the belly of the beast. Yeah. You know what I'm saying, brother? Yeah. We in the belly of the beast, man. And we calling out all of the damn garbage and wickedness and madness of this damn world. Yeah, because we have to because Satan is moving continually. He's working continually. So we have to also. That's right, bro. That's why we ain't got no problem standing out here, all right, telling you people that you're wicked and the Lord is going to destroy you. Okay. Look at it. We, we have no watched, problem telling you that. We just watched Fox Business News. I don't know whether it was the five or whatever it was. We saw the clip where they had them. Um, they they made it seem like um the the, the, the um the um cars was being attacked in the airport over there. Right. 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 Coming back from um Tel Aviv. A lot of psyops. Yeah, you right. Well, and then, yo, we look at that shit. That shit look like a, um it, it looked made up. And then you have the um. You had the news chick on there, um, Morris or um, Morgan Ortegas. She was crying like a, a, a mother, cause she's a she got a a, a child by a, by a car's off. And the and Israel and the Israelite chick Harris Faulkner got a child by a car's off. So they both like yeah. So the um the other chick she telling um Harris Faulkner like um. Like yo, I, I worried about you and, 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 and my daughter and your daughter because we gotta be we're mothers of um Jewish we got Jew, of a Jew, Jew, Jewish children, so the, the, we we're targets. And she make the fake tear. I, I, you know how females could could make that shit appear real with the tears, man. I'm, I you heard me laughing. I was like, yo, they did this shit. Let me see the shit. I said I had to save the clip. It's made up. I know I'm blabbering. Yeah, I'm all over the place. But I'm like, yo, they making it seem like these cars are a victim. It's all made up shit. Yo, I seen some videos, bro. The psyops is real. They got Israeli families. Literally, they're paid actors. You know, some dude, some some guy, some some kid was like, yeah, they 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 killed my uh, my mom and my dad died on top of me or some weird shit. He said, my, he said my dad said his leg was think his leg is blown off, and then the chick, the, 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 his sister started laughing and shit on camera. Yeah, hey, yo, and, man, and, this, this, this 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 stuff is out there. And then whatever airport they came back from, coming back from Tel Aviv, I'm looking like yo, it ain't no tight security in there. You know how tight the security is? They they so called got a um, they so called protecting the civilians from terrorists. And, and drugs being smuggled. Yo, I'm looking at this shit. This shit look like this shit is staged. You hear me? Yeah, bro. I'm like, yo. Uh -huh. Yo, there's a lot. There's a lot. There's a lot of psyop bullshit going on in this world. Which means what? Deception. Showing us that what? That's the type of world that we're living. We're living in a fake, 
fabricated world. Yeah, yeah, kind of know I got something. Living in a fake, fabricated world, man. Things are not what they appear to be. I'm waiting for this pop-up. Because everybody's goddamn lying every goddamn way. You're not yeah. a so-called Native American either. Yeah. You're a devil. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> Native to Satan. Oh. Um, Second Corinthians 2 and 11. Lest Satan should get an advantage of us, for we are not ignorant of his devices. Yeah, who's Satan? Who's the physical counterpart? You so-called white people, man. All right? You so-called white people is Satan, man. Look what you're doing. Look, look, look what you're doing on earth, man. Lying all over the place. All right? Being a bunch of goddamn freaks. All right? All of this bull crap going on in the world, man. It's because of you so-called white people, man. You got the power. You're running every goddamn thing, man. You see? Yeah. All roads, all fingers point to the so-called white man. How about that? All fingers point to the so-called white man. This is first John, this first John 2 and 15. Love not the world neither the things that are in the world. If any man love the world, the love of the Father is not in him. Yeah, man, this world belongs to Esau. This world belongs to Esau. And we're Jacob. You know what I'm saying? Think about that for a second. See, that's Apostle John speaking through the Spirit. Because even at that time, that's the same one that went that was exiled to the Isle of Patmos, right? Um. Yes. You know? And he was what? He was exiled to the Isle of Patmos in what empire? The Roman Empire. Yeah. Salt mines, right? That's right, the salt mines, bro. And that's when the Roman Empire ruled. Which was ran by who? Those those twelve wicked feathers, man. Yeah. I believe uh which one was it, brother? That uh put that, that exiled him to the salt mine. What what's Caesar? What so like, I forget, I forget. Yeah, we all we gotta do is look at the timeline because it's 96 AD. Who was ruling in 96 AD? You'll get your answer of yeah. what emperor ruled during that time. How about that one? That's yeah. a that's a nugget to study. Okay, so love not the world, neither the things that are in the world, man. We're, and now we're 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 back in the revived yeah. Roman Empire. You know. We're back in the revived Roman Empire, man. We don't love this goddamn place. We hate this place. We have indignation for this place. Go ahead, bro. Yeah. For all that is okay. in the world, the lust of the flesh and the lust of the eyes and the pride of life is not of the Father, but is of the world. See? And this is what these so-called celebration of these holidays are all about. The pride of life, lust of the flesh, the yeah. lust of the eyes. That's what these are, you know, because you see women walking out here, you know, they ass and everything showing, you know. They're like, God damn, man. You can only lust so much. You gotta start to ask yourself, what the fuck is this all about, man? What is this all about? Cause you damn sure can't just walk up on a woman and take her. What is this? What is the meaning of all of this? It's a destructive result. That's right, my boy. Most this likely, they, 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 she's somebody else. She belongs exactly. to somebody else. Exactly. Or if not, it's a distraction. Exactly. You know what I mean? Exactly. It's not a positive. Yo, you got. No, you I, got I'll it. be here with Daily Fuller. Yeah, that's yo. right. It's not that's a constructive right. result. That's right, bro. And I was you just know? talking to the brother about that earlier. Like, look. The main thing about, you know, what we're dealing with in this society, we got to tell ourselves what is the constructive result. Yeah. We got to ask ourselves that. What's the constructive result? All right, I want to do this. Why I want to do it. Right. How do I plan to do it? But what do I expect the, the constructive result to be? Yeah. I remember, I remember this morning, you know, I, I remember this morning, you know, we wasn't going to camp this morning, and I didn't have to be, I, didn't, I had a job lined up, I didn't have to be there yet. 
So I was about to watch a I was about to watch El Folio, just a regular show I like. And I'm like, nah, nah, nah. I gotta, I gotta put on something constructive, y'all. I, I, y'all fought against that shit. Yeah, yeah, you bro. saw his one. Yeah, yeah, I was yeah, like, yeah. yo, I was like, yo, here, put on something. I put on, I put on a little, a little yeah, videos yeah, yeah, of good. Obadiah and um. That's right. That's right. And, um, that's it, bro. That's it. And I think Fox Business News. Right. I had to fight through it. I was looking at some investing stuff. But yeah, they, at least that was better than um, yeah, being, better, um watching my regular show. So I'm like, yo, I'm like, no, regular, not, not, you, like, bro. not, not lessons, but, yeah, you know, so I was like, yo, I, I fought against it. Yeah, but, bro. It, it is what, it, you know what I'm saying? It, 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 it is what it is. And yeah. we do our best to just remain, you know, in this, you know, spiritual. That's yeah. all. We're not saying, brothers out there, make sure you're watching videos every day. Which you know, if you're if you're in the spirit, and you're really you're really uh you you're concerned about what's going on, you know what I'm saying? Yes. You 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 don't have to tell a brother to make sure you're watching videos. You ain't got to tell a brother that, cause he should be already watching videos. What's the big deal? You know what I'm saying? Cause cause now what we seeing is what's, what's going on is man, this shit is this shit is really uh, heating up, man. It's really at a, we really at a pivotal time. Yeah. You know, about when all hell is about to break loose. Go ahead. This is Jeremiah 30 and 7. Alas, for that day is great, so that none is like it. Yeah. It is, oh. No, go ahead. It is even the time of Jacob's trouble. That's what we're saying. That's what we're bringing out here. The time of Jacob's trouble. Do you know that the time of Jacob's trouble is going to be so bad you gonna wish you repented from all your bullshit. Celebrating some damn Halloween. Okay? That's what the scripture's talking about. It says, alas, that day has come. When that day comes, you're gonna wish you had listened to the prophets of Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai, man. You're gonna wish you had stopped celebrating some damn Halloween in that time. Cause the Lord gonna get your ass, man. Yes. The Lord gonna get you. Ain't nobody escaping, man. Yeah. See? The most high is a power to be feared. Yeah. Go ahead, brother. Jeremiah 30 and 7. Alas, for that day is great, so that none is like it. It is even a time of Jacob's trouble, but he shall be saved out of it. Yeah, who that, who that, who's that Jacob that's going to be saved out of it? Get Amos, the ninth chapter, and I want to see, what is it, the 10th uh, verse? Amos 9, and, oh, give me a second. Yeah, because it says, Jacob shall be saved out of it. Oh, you want 9? Um, 9 and 9? Oh, no, I want that's it, that's it. All right. This is Amos 9 and 9. This is the Jacob that's going to be saved out of it. Go ahead. For lo, I will command and I will sift the house of Israel among all nations. Like as corn is sifted in the seed. That's being done as we speak. You got camps all over the earth. Okay? Not just out here in New York, but all over the earth, man. All throughout the, the states. Go ahead. Yet shall not the least grain fall upon the earth. Go ahead. All the sinners, all the sinners of my people shall die by the sword. See, that's the ones that's not going to be saved. That's the two thirds, bro. Yeah. That's the ones that's going to wish that they had listened. They knuckleheaded asses had listened and repented for their bullshit. Yep. All the sinners of my people shall die by the sword. By the what? By the sword. See, who, who was blessed with the sword? Esau. See? And so, Esau is a yeah. Caucasian race. That's it. And they were blessed with the sword. That's right. And that's going to entail Jacob's trouble. Yeah. Right? You just read it. You just read it, brother. Jeremiah yeah. 30 and 7. So, because um that shows who Esau is and who yeah. Jacob is because um, brother, do you know any um any of the tribes that um that manufacture weapons on a nationwide and a worldwide scale? Not at all. There's I'm none. not saying who sell, I mean make them. They design right, right. them. Exactly, exactly. You got, I, I, exactly. I mean, exactly. 
Exactly. Engineers them. Right, right, right. That's right, bro. And not own these companies. That's right, bro. None of them, bro. It's all, all right. E. It's all E. Yeah. See? That's oh, right, bro. Yep. All the sinners of my people shall die by the sword. Die by the sword. Go ahead. Which say that evil shall not overtake nor prevent us. So there's your Jacob's trouble that's coming real soon. That's what we're headed into, people. We're heading into a time of great trouble for the so-called blacks, Latinos, Native Americans, and you so-called white people. You Joe Schmo Edomites out here, man. That's just living your regular American lives. Executive orders and, and, and bullshit legislation is being passed right now. This is the so-called holiday too, right? So they do yes, things on these Christmas, New Year's, all of these days, they they doing a ritual. Somebody's being sacrificed, right, bro. and legislation being passed. Some wicked act is being done and committed right now as we speak. That's right, brother. Water for saying that. You just, you just made me think about you. You don't understand what the what's really going on out there in Sonoma County right now. Yeah. Okay. In California right now. What other places, man? And, and, and there's other places I don't, I don't know of, but it showed them on a show Billions. The, this last season, they show like, they got Sonoma County type territories in different spots. I think you got one near Canada, something like that. I wouldn't that. be surprised. But you know yeah, where, they got the, where, they, where they have an owl carved with that's wood and, they, and, 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 they, and they're erected. That's right, that's right. So they got, they got different like Sonoma, Sonoma County type places in forests where right, they brother. perform those rituals. See, Sonoma County is like the most known. The headquarters, yeah. That's like the most known, but you were absolutely right. Yeah. Because I believe that myself. I know them. that it's, it's more than yeah. one, just one hub of witchcraft in America, man. The yep. Lord called this place the mistress of witchcraft. Okay? But we know Sonoma County, all right, in the uh, Redwood Forest, is one of the top ones, but is there's plenty of them. They have one in a cold location, yo. I was like, oh shit. If I find a clip, I'm gonna put it in the chat, Lord. We're both chats. Got any more on that, but, um, Yeah, man. We just painting the picture through the spirit. We out here to tell you what's coming to pass. How the Lord gonna judge your wicked asses, man. Yep. In Wait. that day will I raise up the tabernacle of David that is fallen and close up the breaches thereof. Ooh. And I will raise up his ruins and I will build it as in the days of old. That's heavy. That's heavy. Watch this. Come on. That they may possess the remnant of Edom. That they may what? That they may possess the remnant of Edom. You know who the remnant of Edom is? The top elite bankers, man. Well, it's a, it's, Edom is a, a, the, the red, the red race, the Caucasians, um, and of all the heathen which are called by my name, saith the Lord, that doeth this. Now get Psalm 137 to, to back that up, my brother. Right. Psalm 137. I got you, Salah. Yep, no, you good. Because, because it said to, to possess the remnant of Edom, which is the elite bankers, all right, the top thirteen Illuminati bloodline families. Yeah, them. Are uh, you one seven? One thirty seven. There it is. You know what it is. This is um Psalms one thirty seven, verse seven and nine. Remember, O Lord, the children of Edom in the day of Jerusalem, which said, "Race it, race it, even to the foundation thereof." O daughter of Babylon, who ought to be destroyed. Once again, that's another scripture that's pointing out Edom and Babylon are synonymous with one another in prophecy. Yes, sir. Edom and Babylon is synonymous with one another in prophecy. Yes. So my, uh, the, the, the prophetic Babylon would be ruled under the rulership of Edom. Okay? That's why it says it the way it says it like that, man. Read on. Yes, sir. Happy shall he be that reward of thee as thou hast served us. Yeah. How did the so-called white man reward you so-called blacks, Latinos, and Native Americans? You niggas in the ghetto, man. 
Yeah. You niggas in the inner cities, man. Yeah, we talking about the nation as a whole. Not your few speckles of, of niggas and specks. You go, you go throughout all of the cities of the world, for that matter. But let's deal with America. From the East Coast to the Midwest to the West Coast, you got so-called blacks, Latinos, Native Americans, where? In the ghetto. Where they at? Yeah, you know that, brother. Shout out to all my eyes, bro. All right, shout out to all my eyes, bro. You know? You know what I'm saying? Where they at? They're in the inner cities. Yes. In the ghettos. Okay? They're not in the damn suburbs, living lavishly. Oh, go ahead. Well, you I did, know, I we did, know. When I, when, I used to do, when I used to work with the move, in a moving job I was in a few years ago. Yeah. Yo, you had a, you had a so-called educated Negro in the hood, living in the hood. Mm -hmm. And this nigga, I didn't say nigga. I didn't mean call him a nigga because he was cool. Yeah. He was cool, he tipped me and everything. He educated. He was educated and he did a TED talk. He was on fucking TV. And he lived in a hood. You know what I mean? So yo, and, and, and the thing is, yeah, bro. when I look through through the um, when I look through the paperwork, Lord willing, I'ma look through it again and see because to see who I'm talking about. Oh, this is folly. <laughs> nah, fuck that. This is folly, bro. Like, what the fuck is this, bro? I, I'm Salak, Salak, cause some things gotta be on video, yeah, man. Yeah, that's, that's a bunch of silly funny. shit, yo. They gonna be, they, and they probably employ Jake. They was Jake in that shit? I don't I know. So. Oh, oh, so. oh, 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 not too far from St. John's and Ocean, that part of Crown Heights. All right. Mm -hmm. Um. So, so what are we saying here, man? Where, where do you see most of Jake? Where do you see most of Jake living at, man? Really Come on, stuff, man. Bro. It's, 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 it's not hard. Just look around you. You niggas are the Israelites, man. You niggas are the Israelites, man. The so-called blacks, Latinos, and Native Americans. Man. Yeah, he was an economist. He was an economist too. Okay. So lot. Ah, you good, bro? Um. All right. Race it, race it, even to the foundation thereof. O daughter of Babylon, who ought to be destroyed, happy shall he be that reward of thee, as thou hast. Serve us. See, happy shall he Watch be. This. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. Happy shall he be that have served. You know what? Read that again. So huh. you. O daughter of Babylon, who ought to be destroyed, happy shall he be that rewardeth thee as thou hast served us. Uh, happy shall he be that rewardeth thee as thou hast served us. All right. You so-called blacks, Latinos, Native Americans have been served. Rape, robbery, and murder, and oppression. Okay, till this day. And I don't want, I don't, I hate to sound like Deontay Wilder, but till this day. And then uh, I know. Uh, forgive me, brothers, if I, if I'm jumping a gun and talking off a topic, but as far as Jake's living in the hood, and then some Jakes, I gotta, I gotta hit both sides. Some Jakes would rather be in the hood. Than to live around the other these other nations, man, because of how they are treated. You get me? Like one Jake, I had a family member. He was living. It was a house. My my people was living upstairs, and the, and the Jake, the, the, as another Jake, he was he lived downstairs, but on the other side of the house, South Side Jamaica, cross street from Baisley. The shit burnt down, and come to find out, the place burned down because of his electrical chair. And come to find out that Jake, that old Jake, he was a millionaire. But pretty, pretty much, I'm pretty sure he stayed in that neighborhood because he'd rather live there in, in the hood than around these other nations and be, and be treated fucked up. That's what, that what, that's what I'm thinking. Because I'm like, yo, this dude had all this money. Why the fuck he was living there? Well, wow, you know, because how, how these other nations treat our people. That's probably why. 
but it's a lot more than that. I just had to, I had to let, put that out there. Yeah, you know, see? Okay. Yeah, so we're going to get one more scripture, Lord, we're going to close uh, it up. Yeah, close it up. It's a lot. Um, this is the last scripture, all right? It's closing. Psalms 137 and 9. Happy shall he be that taketh and dasheth thy little ones against the stones. See that? See how it all comes together? Because recompense is required. Recompense is required from the Most High. Okay? How we've been dealt, okay, we went off. You know, we went off and uh, the elect of the nation of Israel is repenting from their going off. The true elect, all right? Not niggas that just know that they're Israelites and just still want to be niggas, get carnal. I got to yeah. say it, bro, because it's been on my spirit. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Niggas want to get carnal. Yo, all camps, all camps. Yo, that was like, all camps, what I, what I saw, what like, I saw come on, when I saw nigga, You character. only pop up when some bullshit when some carnal shit come come yeah, about, yeah. nigga. He do look like that nigga from Flash Gordon, though. That's a good movie, though. You gotta watch it. It's a yeah, classic. Yeah, I gotta see that, that shit had me rolling when, it, when I saw the, the red, the red, the aura, and then... Yeah. <laughs> I'm calling all camps. Yeah, yeah. All camps. We gonna ride for our brothers at WFI. God damn it. Like, come on, man. You only popping up when some carnal shit go down. Yeah. Man, all right. Anyway, we not in that. We not on. We not on that time, my nigga. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Cause that's how you move. You move like a nigga, man. Yeah. All right. We on that. We on that spiritual time. Yeah. We dealing. We letting your how about you know shot deal with everything. That man. nigga's on nigga time. He's on nigga time, bro. And that's just the fact. Nigga time. Don't care. What you say or what, how you feel about it. I know a nigga when I hear one. And damn it, that sounded like a nigga to me, bro. Sound like a, a nigga that just wanted to get, want, 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 want to get into some shit. Just want to get into some shit, man. God damn. It's a lot, Lord. Yeah, don't worry about it. <laughs> I mean, you know I'm, she saying, I'm not you the know Lord. She is. You know she is, I'm, so like, I'm not the Lord, I'm just saying, I'm just. I'm, you, you know I'm, she is, all right. Oh yeah, yeah, you know that. God damn it. But anyway, man, we be giving all praises to your help. Howard. By Shim, Yahweh Shad, by Shim Kakwadash. Low only you brothers, you know, to stay tuned, stay spiritual, and Lord willing until next time. Shalom. Shalom.